Well, actually, there was a lot of things that made me decide on UNC. One, I'm originally from the South, so I wanted to be a, a lot closer to home than I was for residency training. But honestly, it was the infectious diseases program and what they were focused on. I really want to spend a lot of my research time and a lot of my professional time focusing on sexually transmitted infections. And so UNC has a really great program for STI research. Um, I found my mentor when I interviewed here and we hit it off very nicely and so it was an environment where I felt like I was supported, where I felt like there were people doing the type of research that I wanted to do. I felt like there weren't any questions or issues about getting funding to support me in my you know, research interests and any other conferences that I wanted to go to. So it's nice to be a part of an environment where they want you to grow, not just as a person, but also professionally too. So the first year is the clinical year, so you do most of your time here in the hospital, either doing the general consult service or the immunocompromised um, consult service. We also spend time at the Durham Health Department, which is great because I want to do public health and I get to do a lot of STD work that way as well. I think what's great about this program is that we actually have microbiology rounds. So we get to go to the micro lab around 1.30 every day and we get to sit down with the actual microbiologist and talk about, you know, any cultures or any other micro questions we have. We actually get the chance to look at the plates and then after we talk about our own cases, our own patients on the service at the moment, we actually have a teaching session too where we go over basic micro, which some of us haven't seen in a while, but it's a nice refresher, and then is able to put that whole micro and clinical aspect together. That way you provide better patient care. Another great thing about this fellowship program is that it allows the fellows to take time to do things outside of clinical work. So the second and the third year is mostly research time, but a lot of our fellows are interested in public health which is one of the strengths of the program, and fellows are allowed to go ahead and pursue an MPH. So I'm excited because I just got accepted into the MPH program here, and so I would spend the next two years um, getting my master's in public health and epidemiology, which is great. You want to make sure that you have great mentorship because at this point it's not just about, you know, what rotations you do, it's who can help prepare you to do the job that you want in the future, who can help mold you and who has time to to put forth the effort to help you grow. But then also, you also want to have a life outside of fellowship, too. You want to find some place that meets all your needs, whether it's social, whether it's for your family, you know, whether it's just for any of the hobbies that you have outside of the hospital. And so I think weighing all of that is the reason why UNC was the perfect choice for me.